Welcome, Virgo, to my channel, Rainbow Wizard Tarot. Today I'll be doing a love reading for Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading. It will not resonate with all of you out there. Thank you so much to all of you that have already subscribed to my channel. And uh, welcome to all of you new viewers today. Um, so yeah, please keep in mind that uh, this is a general reading. Uh, if it doesn't resonate, take what does and leave the rest. Um, you can also check out other signs in your chart. I find that uh, Venus and Moon sign, Rising sign can um, give additional love messages. I'll leave the link in the description box for that. So uh, Virgo, let's see what the middle of December has in store for you and the person that you desire and love. All right, so there, um, somebody's blowing up someone's phone here. There is uh, lines of communication have recently been opened. Um, somebody is contacting you very frequently, yeah, very, very passionate uh, communication here. And uh, somebody is desiring and have expressed that they want a new beginning with you. It's a lot of passion between you and this person here, Virgo. So, uh, yeah, you, you could have recently connected and, uh, yeah, are uh, now frequently speaking to each other. You could be dealing with somebody that is Aries, Leo or Sagittarius. Um, they are very passionate about you and uh, they are expressing that they want a new beginning with you. They could have come in very sudden, very recent as well. You have found this connection to be a burden in the past um, that has been weighing on you, Virgo, but you are nearly at the stage where you are releasing any past burdens with you and your person. This is, has been a connection. It's been going through ups and downs, so on and off. Here, but uh, yeah, it's coming to an end here because a new beginning is here with you and your person here. So it could also be travel between you two, definitely a lot of messages back and forth, quite frequent. This is somebody that is very passionate about you, Virgo. And uh, yeah, they want balance in this connection here. If there have, hasn't been balance before, there will be more harmony and balance and equal give and take here with the temperance. Um, you could be dealing with the Sagittarius here as well. And you are their wish fulfillment here, Virgo. They wished upon a star and they met you. They want this connection back on track here. You could also be with it, dealing with an Aquarius star sign. Um, in the past there, there could have been a third party situation here. Uh, it could also mean that you've had um, you know, a lot of celebrations and they want to continue celebrating with you. Obviously there is Christmas time now and they want to get together with you. They're definitely reaching out to make plans with you. But also this could be that in the past there has been interruptions of a third party here and in the love, a love life here. And uh, um, yeah, they have been and this is somebody that is coming in to speak their truth. And you, you could also be dealing with a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra here. Somebody that's um, matured. They're coming in here as a king and wants to come in and tell you the truth and how they've changed and how they want this new beginning with you because you are their wish fulfillment, uh, Virgo, here. So the hermit, you're coming up in your own reading here, Virgo. You've been taking that time out to, to reflect uh, on your life, on your emotions, you feel quite clear headed on what you want uh, with yourself. So you're feeling good and strong here. The hermit and the, the high priest is very similar. Somebody that is just taking that time out to really reflect and focusing on uh, yourself here just to rest. And uh, now you're coming out slowly but surely and you are ready, ready to conquer the world here and start a new beginning. Virgo, somebody here could have recently become single and will be expressing that to you. They have left the third party behind. They're somebody here that has good wealth and health and just are have improved. So maybe when you see this person that you can't even recognize them. This is a very spiritual connection here with a high priestess. You've followed your gut feeling in this connection here and you 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 felt that this connection here is not over yet and it's very true it's not over somebody is very passionate about you and they want to work on this connection here they really want to put the work in because they love you and they have not been able to let go of this special connection with you in the past you've made them extremely happy you could be dealing with a leo virgo but yeah you have happiness together it's a it's a wish fulfillment um there could have been arguments between you in the past or hurdles to go through where it's been difficult to get this off the ground or even maintain a relationship. So there was a break here. 
but um, these hurdles and obstacles are over because you both realize that you are each other's wish fulfillment and you want to to create this happiness together the the, the happiest card in the deck here it could have been a, a competition around this connection here you are both very attractive people there are admirers around you virgo and uh, yeah you are looking good smelling good and you're taking care of yourself so they know that they have to come in fast unless they are going to lose you to someone else here um, so yeah, they're seeing you as someone that is um, holding back your emotions a bit. You are very kind and very open-minded, appearing here as the Queen of Swords, uh, Virgo. Maybe you have also in your chart, you have strong air. So you're just holding back a bit, but you do want a new beginning also. This is the Ace of Cups, uh, of Cups one of my favorite cards. This is a new beginning. This is all about abundance of love, where time, place and distance cannot break the bond between you. When you two get together, it's like it was yesterday and it would just flourish and start all up again and you will be able to move on from these past hurdles because there is so much love between you two. It's just an abundance of love here and uh, somebody could have gone through a divorce so there is a justice now coming in towards you here. Uh, it could be also you, um, Virgo, but it's justice coming back into this connection here in a brand new start. So yes, there is a heartbreak here that has happened in the past between both of you, but this could also be that one of you are leaving someone. Again, there will be a heartbreak because you are wanting to invest in this new beginning here with each other. So this, you have chosen each other and they have chosen you. There you are, Queen of Pentacles. It is you that they want and you that they desire. So they want to close cycles in the past if there's been any, uh, any, uh, grief between uh, you and them in the past they want to move completely it seems that you both have healed they want to start over again they are closing a cycle uh, on their side ending a third party here you have three of swords uh, three of cups maybe they're dealing with a libra but somebody's closing a cycle with someone here to start a new beginning with you and here we have the two suitors king of pentacles and king of uh king and queen basically these are a, a perfect match here a perfect match and you are coming together both of you could have a lot of earth in your chart but it could be the person you're seeing the signs that i'm seeing it could be virgo libra uh, aquarius um fire signs leo especially uh, aries as uh, well as uh, sagittarius here they want a high level of commitment with you um and they're going to express that virgo they really want a high level of commitment because they know that this is a spiritual connection. They know this is a very, very powerful connection that you have. And they, some of them could even express that, they, that uh, they want to marry you. And here, yeah, the emperor. They want to come in as your emperor. It could be dealing with an Aries here. But uh, they feel now that it's the divine timing here is come into place. And that now is the time to take a leap of flip faith to travel towards each other and start over again they do not want to waste any more time they want to get this all off the ground again in december and they are praying and hoping and following their gut feeling that you uh, are ready to forgive and forget or you have healed from uh, any break breakup that uh, went down uh, with you two in the past uh, there seemed to have been a separation with you two but uh, yeah it seemed enough time has gone there's been healing one of you could have in the meantime been seeing someone but it didn't work out because this is a very spiritual connection there's a lot of love here and uh, it doesn't matter if you are uh, in a time place and who you have been with it seemed that you are like magnets to each other and are um, have this attraction you're just uh, you are going to get together and uh, they are counting on here with the wheel of fortune is turning in this connections for uh, favor here let's see what the romance angels uh, just to give some additional messages here uh, for you for the middle of uh, uh, December Virgo so we have here make the effort so it's time to make the effort underneath the deck. We have passion, a lot of passion here. Um, yeah, is it safe? You will be questioning, is it safe now to love here? Can we forgive uh, because of these, uh, you know, uh, this what happened between you two before? But there is so much love here that uh, whatever's happened, apply it to your situation here with this connection in the past. It seems the time is now 
to to move on and you both have had enough time to heal because they love you and they have a lot of passion for you here and this is also past life relationship here with a high priestess it's just one of these you can't even explain the connection that you have with each other but somehow you just always get back together here as well somebody could have been in a codependent uh, relationship uh, in between so they're trying to shake that off um, the, and that could be with a divorce here as well um, they are letting their friends help them here as well to get out of this because they know this is true love this is the romance of a lifetime with you and them then they realize and reconciliation someone from your past is returning to your life here because this is your soulmate Virgo you cannot run away from the soulmate they will always come back to you and the wheel of fortune is turning in this connection's favor in the middle of December Virgo these were the messages for you for the middle of December if this resonated with you, please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.